completely sterile air. It really is. It's really pure. So I cultured in front of those hoods. I've got pantry plates. You might see some vials um, and everything. Those are for bacteria. Um, once I sterilize, I sterilize a lot of that sawdust. Remember the spawn you were using? Mm -hmm. That's where you see all these bags, and all the bags on the floor is because our walk-in cooler is down the street at our house. <laughs> so um, these are just colonized and waiting for that to be to be built so I can clean up the floor. This is just a way of keeping them cool until I can get them out of here. So I'm just kind of keeping them cool. Um, once they are cultured, uh, we could take a mushroom and clone it. We can open it up and put it on a pastry plate, and it grows. The mycelium grows. Then we can transfer it to grain and eventually to the sawdust that you were using today. Did any of you notice a little bit of grain yeah. here and there? So that's what that was. That's a stage. Um, it likes to go from auger plate to grain to sawdust and then to logs or wood. So each one of those bags that you're using actually gets multiplied. Did you also look at the label on the bag? Did you notice there were some codes like A1, B3? You know, um, So those are how I track the codes in here. So they'll stay in here for about three to four transfers. So every little pastry plate I have in the fridge, a little tiny pastry plate, in 11 weeks, if I transfer it every week at a factor of 10, each pastry plate can grow about a million pounds of mushrooms in 11 weeks. So <laughs> I don't need a million pounds of mushrooms. <laughs> you know, I wish I could sell a million pounds a week. But um, so my my job is to actually throttle them. I have to throttle them and slow them down. Um, and I only need X amount a week. So what I do is I put them on ice. I go in the walk-in cooler, or they gotta go somewhere. So the little shoot. There's a little shoot. You see where the triangular logo is. That's where the spawn goes, and it never comes back. It's a one-way street. So it'll transfer here a few times. It'll go to that room. Okay, then each one of those bags gets made into a lot more bags in that space. So there's a big sterilizer in there. It's huge. And then that one makes it sterilizes and bags and does everything. And then it goes to the, it goes to a colonization room and a fruiting room. All right, you'll get to see the colonization in the fruiting room.